Author's Preface The life story that you are about to read of Acharyaman Purita Tatera, his way of practice and his moral goodness, is the result of extensive research which I conducted in consultation with many Acharyas of his discipleship, who lived with him throughout various periods of his monastic life. I sought out these Acharyas, recorded their memories of him, and compiled their recollections to write this biography. This account is not as completely accurate as I wished, because it was virtually impossible for the monks to remember all the many experiences that Acharya Man conveyed to them about his life as a wandering forest monk. But, if I were to wait for every detail to be recalled before writing this biography, it would only be a matter of time before all information is forgotten and forever lost. All hope of recording his story for the edification of interested readers would then be surely lost as well. With great difficulty, I composed this biography, and, although it is incomplete, my hope is that it will prove to be of some benefit to the reader. I shall attempt to depict the many aspects of Atariyaman's daily conduct, as well as the knowledge and insights he attained and elucidated to his disciples. I intend to illustrate his noble life in the style of the venerable Acharyas of antiquity, who transcribe the essence of the lives of the Buddha's Arahant disciples into ancient texts, ensuring that all future generations will have some understanding of the results that are possible when the Tamma is practiced sincerely. May the reader forgive me if my presentation of Atariyaman's life appears inappropriate in any way. Yet the truth is that it is a factual account, representing the memories of Atariyaman Purita Tatera's life as he himself conveyed them to us. Although I am not wholly comfortable with the book, I have decided to publish it anyway, because I feel that readers interested in Tamma may gain some valuable insight.